What's up, everybody? Natalie busted my balls a little bit, but that's all right. You know, am I lazy? Uh, uh you know, I, I, I am. I don't really have a problem admitting that. Um, I suppose maybe the thing about uh, feeling it was not so much about getting motivated to work as being demotivated to work. And maybe that's a whole different thing. I don't really want to, you know, get into a whole, a whole thing about that subject necessarily. But um, I think it was more that. And I think uh, to me, um, that's 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 somewhat of a more uh, valid excuse. Not necessarily laziness, just sort of being driven to. Uh, Maybe being driven to laziness, does that make sense? Like if you have a if you have a cold or something, I don't think you're necessarily being lazy if you don't leave the house when you have a cold. You just don't really feel like doing anything. It does put me in the mind of one of my pet peeves and I don't really want to go like off into these other subjects, but um, <laughs> it really, it, one thing that really bothers me is when people say they don't have time to do something. Um, I mean, it sort of depends on uh, what needs to be done and, and, and the situation, but um, like, uh, I don't know, say 87% of the time, I think it's just total bull. I don't feel like it's so much that people don't have time as much as they don't want to make time. And I wish people would just say that. Like, to me, it sounds more honest if you just say, you know what, this is something that right now isn't worth my time. I don't want to make time for this. You know, it's kind of like uh, to use the analogy of, uh, you know, the person that you really wanted to get a, go on a date with. If you got that date, you would find the time. You know what I mean? Um, if you really liked someone, you would make that time. And that's the way I feel about other projects or, or ambitions. Um, if you really want to do that, you will find the time. And um, so I think it's... If, if nothing else, it's, uh, it's, it's more honest. I've, I personally feel it's more honest if someone says they just don't feel like it. <laughs> you know, whether feel like it is even a euphemism for, uh, for being lazy, it's, it's better to me. Karen, happy birthday. I, um, I probably should have said that at the beginning of last week. Because uh, I even knew when it was. What do I do to get inspired? I've come, I've come to realize that I don't really seem to do art for art's sake. Um, I tend to do art to supplement things. Before YouTube, I mean, there were long stretches where I didn't really do anything um, artistic, um, unless it was um, for someone else, and which is, um, I mean, which I, I, I like. To draw things, I guess I've I've never really been able to um, put myself behind something unless there's kind of a purpose to it, whether people are going to see it or um, you know, or whether it's uh, whether it's useful or something like that. But the thing about being inspired is that uh, I mean I don't know I get inspired by everything. Uh, inspiration is sort of all around, and I mean I've got so many ideas for different things that just never get done. You know, it's just it's uh, it's just everywhere. I don't I don't know if I have any any one uh, any one thing that I go to that that uh, makes me say, hmm, you know, uh, and do this. Um, so I don't know. Um, <laughs> peace.